The F-22 Raptor is considered the most supreme fighter jet in the world that defines air dominance. Deploying the fifth generation fighter jets is no easy task and must be practiced. More than 400 airmen from the 325th Fighter Wing prepare the 95th Fighter Squadron to deploy during Exercise Crown Royal. Conducting exercise like this is so important to Tendall because it helps us uh, have confidence that we can actually do it and prepare for it when, it, uh, when it's uh, needed. So as you know, we want to get out the door as quickly as we possibly can when our nation calls. And exercises like this help us to do that. The 325th Maintenance Group is tasked with generating 18 F-22s within a few days. This presents the airmen with a unique challenge. In a typical unit, they will be able to take parts from a sister squadron to get their aircraft generated up. 18 ship here took that out of the equation for us. Our people really had to jump through hoops and make some magic happen to get 18 aircraft healthy. The maintenance airmen aren't the only ones who are asked to go above and beyond their normal duties. The 325th Logistics Readiness Squadron stand up an augmentee program in order to teach airmen from other career fields how to assist with cargo and passenger processing. We do exercises at a Raptor base because at any moment we could uh, be sending all of our uh, fighters out the door and we got to be ready. What I find rewarding about this exercise is when the training we applied to our augmentees is applied to real world and I see the airmen moving cargo and getting the mission done. This is some of this unprecedented in F-22 history. A single squadron being able to generate as many aircraft as we did and get them out the door is a, something that we can really take pride in. Whenever the world requires Tyndall's F-22 Raptors, they can meet the challenge. Staff Sergeant Russ Jackson, Tyndall Air Force Base, Florida.